I'm going to show you how you can use your Galaxy S6 as a mobile hotspot to share its LTE connection with other devices like a laptop, gaming system, or tablet. And what you need to do is go to your settings to turn this on. If you have a Verizon model, it's actually really handy because you can add a shortcut to the notification center. If you don't see it right here, tap on that little edit button and you may have it down here. You may need to drag it up. Use it all the time, so I like to keep it there. If it's here on your model, you can tap that and then hit OK and it's on. It's really all there is to turning it on. Now, you can also tap and hold on this and it'll take you right into the settings. Super handy. If you don't have that, you're gonna have to pull down, go into settings, scroll down to more, mobile hotspot, and then turn it on. Bit of a pain in the butt, and if you use it often, you can look for a widget. We haven't found one yet that works on the Galaxy S6. Hopefully there'll be one in the near future. Tap on more because we want to change this default name and password. So I'm going to configure it. We'll delete this. And we'll say Josh's Hotspot. We'll hit save. We'll go to more. Works best if you turn it off so it doesn't reboot in between different ones. I actually want to go down here and change the password to something that makes sense. Like, gotta be mobile. And then it will turn it on. And now we can share devices. Now we can also choose only allow devices or allow any device. And if you have allow all devices, that is they have to know this password, so it's not like anyone can just join. Be careful how many devices you share this with and what you do while connected, because this is an easy way to use a lot of data. If you found this useful, please hit like and subscribe, and check out a link in the description to more of our Samsung Galaxy S6 tips and tricks.